I'm Larry Taunton. I'm executive director of Fixed Point Foundation, a nonprofit that's dedicated to defending and proclaiming the Christian message. And it's in that role that I have engaged some of the most vociferous critics of the Christian faith to come to know some of them uh, rather personally, uh, individuals like Christopher Hitchens and Richard Dawkins and, and many others. And uh, uh, The Grace Effect is a, is a book that that explores some of their ideas, specifically those ideas that say that the world would be a better place without religion and without Christianity in particular. And so this, this particular book uh, uh, begins with a, a conversation between Christopher Hitchens uh, and myself. We're sitting at a restaurant late one night and he's telling me that the world would, would be a better place without it, and uh, that is without Christianity. And I'm trying to explain to him um, that, no, that no, it wouldn't. Uh, Christopher, you don't want to live in a, in, in a world without Christians in it. But I can tell that the argument uh, has an abstract quality, and, uh, and, and so the, the, there's something lacking in the, in the force of my argument. A couple of weeks later, I, my wife and I are in Ukraine finalizing the adoption of, uh, of Sasha, uh, uh, who is now our daughter. And um, you know, I didn't see much connection between my professional life, defending the Christian faith, and my personal life, adopting Sasha. Um, certainly both were motivated by Christian conviction, but, uh, you know, they, they were, they were uh, two different realms, or so I thought. And uh, as our time in Ukraine drags on and uh, we begin to experience, uh, you know, we begin to see a world um, without Christianity, a world of corruption, a, a world of abuse, uh, a world without grace. Um, those two worlds began to converge and I began to see that that conversation with Christopher Hitchens, um, that it was being played out uh, in the adoption with, of, of Sasha. Here through our little girl, we began to see the kind of world the, the ivory tower theorists would give us. And so the grace effect is, is in essence saying, let's, let's take uh, the, what, what the, the, the liberal elitists are telling us, let's see how their theories, uh, uh, what they look like when they're taken out of the sterile environment of the university and they're, they're employed in a real flesh and blood world, in this case through Sasha herself. So I think you'll want to read The Grace Effect because it's not like so many books that, that deal with, with this issue. That is, they, they tend to feel very, uh, uh, very esoteric, very academic, um, like a textbook. Uh, that's my world and I don't even want to read books like that. So uh, The Grace Effect is a narrative and it's through Sasha that you begin to see uh, the redemptive power of Christianity and how as individuals themselves are redeemed, whole societies are redeemed. So this isn't a, a, a book you're going to want to re read because you're seeking to be educated. It's a book that will educate you because you want to read the story.